What's up ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, today's video is an exciting one, they always are to me. Uh, today's video has a long awaited product, uh, you might be looking at this and wondering what is going on, why do I have a carton of milk? Um, this is the Marnie Premium Tournament Collection Box, um, this is a product that has proven quite challenging to get for some people. Um, it is priced the same as an ETB, £42.50, um, and the contents are similar to an ETB, believe it or not. This is quite a small thing. As you can see, there's my hands. I have quite normal sized hands. Here is a Pokemon card. So it's, it's not really that much bigger than a Pokemon card itself. But there's quite a lot of contents in here. This is very desired um, because this is our full art Marnie. She comes as a promo card, the uh, English equivalent of the Marnie from Shiny Star V. Uh, I think a lot of people were hoping that would appear in Shining Fates. It didn't. People were asking questions about, you know, where is it? We need this full art Marnie. And it's inside this carton of milk, um, which is an interesting product design from Pokemon. Perhaps it is indication of them trying to condense products down a little bit more. Who knows? Very unique product. Very, very, very heavily allocated in the UK. I think uh, some stores were told they were only getting one display unit of this, which is four. Um, so it, from what I've seen, a lot of people have had their pre-orders cancelled. Um, any kind of store that has these online quickly, um, any store that has these online, they will quickly sell out. Um, these are already on eBay. This is day of release. These were on eBay yesterday for £65, £70, pound, um, and they are up here at £42.50. So, very desired product. This is just like Shining Fates Day 1 right now. Um, if you can get hold of one of these at RRP, I would recommend you do it. The other thing is, there doesn't seem to be indication of a second print run of this product. The distributors have kind of said, here's what you're getting. We haven't been told any more is coming. So, this could be a product that Pokemon have just said, here you go, have that, that's it, we're moving on to the next thing. If that's the case, this is going to be a very desirable product as time goes on. Um, anyway, enough talking, we're going to get it open. Okay, so as I mentioned, it's a bit like an ETB in terms of the products you get. There is our Full Art Marnie, the sealed. A very nice card. Okay, so we have our Full Art Marnie card. This is a promotional card. This is the card from Shining, uh, Shiny Star V, which is the chase card in a set that has both Charizard V Max and uh, Charizard V Shiny. So very desirable card. And we have, I believe there's three copies of this card, which is the signed Marnie card. This is also a promo card, but you get three copies of it. Um, very cool card, very unique. I believe there is six other, um, six other cards like this, where they have kind of their own stamp on them. Um, not sure if we will ever get the rest of them. I would imagine we will, but this is a very nice card. And I believe, I've been told, you can see a swirl on some of them. If you get lucky, you can get a pretty decent swirl. But uh, we'll put those to the side for now, show you the rest of the contents. So, so just like I need to be able to get a coin, very cool large money coin there. We get some nice dice, die even. We get the money sleeves, very pink and bold. Um, 65 though, just like it needs to be. We get a deck box, which is pretty cool. I do not play the game currently, but that's cool. And then we get our packs of cards. Seven packs inside here, as I said, it's effectively an ETB. These are a mixture of packs, have a little bit of everything in here, some Chilling Raid, uh, Battle Stars, Darkness Blaze, and Movie Voltage. We will do Battle Stars first, then Darkness of Blaze, then Chilling Raid, uh, Voltage, and then Chilling Raid. One, two, three, and the energy. We have Swordwood and Shieldwood, Carnivine, Bruxish, Spoink, Mawile, Cacnea, Corfish, Timber, Reverse Hollow, Rapid Strike, Scroll of Swirls, and a Cherim Non Hollow. One, two, three, and the energy. We have a Pig Knight, a Dewblade, Dotler, Esper. Frillish, Relicary, Spoink, Cacnea, Reverse Hollow Grumpig, and a Salazzle Non Hollow. Hoping for the Charizard VMAX from this. 
This is a regular VMAX card, it's not a secret rare. Fire energy, sign of things to come. We have a ferret, a rare fossil, Fletchinder, Wishy Washy, Rookie D, Aaron, Torchic, Glory Mr. Mime, Reverse Hollow, Tapu Koku, and a Toxtricity Non Hollow. Uh, holo. It's a cool looking card. I need a vivid voltage time. We have a Steel Energy, we have a Zeb Striker, Coating Energy, Heroes Medal, Voltorb, Rockruff, Talo, Yanma, Weeper, Reverse Holo Gogo, -Go, and a Lucario Non Holo. One, two, three, and the Energy Fighting Energy. We've had six, five different energies so far. Path to the Peak, Ledian, Welcoming Lantern, Larvesta, Inke, Rockruff. Ghastly, Ladybar, Reverse Holy Thwacky, and a Spiritomb. One, two, three, and the Energy, Lightning Energy. We have a Drizzle, a Cybold, Melanie, just a car behind her, Blitzel, Quillfish, Glowing Sloper, Weedle, Clubberpus, Reverse Holy Malamar, and a Zarude. The cut on these cards is interesting, very heavy on the bottom. That is a uh, chilling rain for you. One, two, three. One, two, three. And the energy. See, is the centering good on the back? It's good, whatever it is, which probably means it's not good. It's not a good card. All of the like full arts I've seen are incredibly like off center. Echoing Horn, Single Strike Scholar Piercing, Avery, Venipede, Boon Sweet, Lapras, Blitzel, Aron, Reverse Holo Gardevoir, that is a rare, that's nice. Oh, we've got something. We've got something. It is a Metagross VMAX. There we go. At least we got a pull from the box. Pretty sure I need that. I haven't opened. The only Chilling Rain I've really opened is what I've opened on the channel. So I'm pretty sure I haven't got that card, so that's cool. Gardevoir is a rare Reverse Holo likely need that as well um so there we go that was the marnie tournament collection box here are the promos again as i said very difficult product to get hold of if you can get hold of one um and it remotely interests you i would grab it while you can i am not expecting this product to appear in abundance i think whatever's out there now is probably all that's going to be at least this year uh the same with chilling rain um Pokemon have kind of said that's it for Chilling Rain. They just released some ETBs. Like I, I just got some ETBs from a distributor who kind of told me they're not expecting any more ETBs. So the odd like shipment might arrive of maybe late ones or you know ones that they forgot to send. But uh, it would appear Pokemon are full steam ahead on the 25th anniversary products. Um, Evolving Skies is going to be a pretty quick wave one situation. Um, so if you see a money box and it interests you, I recommend you get hold of one because uh, it's only going to go up in value. As I said, the box is selling for £70 on eBay already, um, so make sure you get hold of one. If you uh, enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below if you've managed to get hold of a money box. Let me know if you managed to get hold of one or not. If you have opened it and what you think of the box, it's a pretty cool product, pretty unique. As I said, it's a milk carton effectively. Um, we have the deck box, which is kind of cool. Um, if you are enjoying the content, please subscribe. Make sure you enter the August giveaway. I do have the Calyrex collection boxes already. Um, they are off screen. I'm not going to grab them right now because they're quite far away. But um, I do have those ready. And as I said, I will update the giveaway this month to include some Evolving Sky stuff when we get a little bit closer to release date. So appreciate you guys watching and peace.